Welcome to RV Quick Tips. Quick Tips. Hey guys, today's Quick Tip session is all about battery maintenance. First of all, don't forget the most basic thing and keep your batteries charged. If they go a couple months without being charged, they're going to die and that's going to be bad. So, you know, every now and then you want to get the, all the corrosion off of your battery posts, open all that stuff up, make sure there's none on there. If there is, just go over it with the wire brush, get them cleaned off as best you can. You know, you can, some people use like Diet Cola and put on there. I've never had good luck with that. It always comes back worse. If you have lead acid batteries, you also just want to take the lid off. Don't get any of that corrosion stuff down in there. But just take the lid off and look down in there and make sure there's plenty of water in there. And then we'll test them. And then if you have lead acid batteries, it's always good to test each one. This is just a couple of dollar tester at Walmart. And the instructions just say to flush it with distilled water a couple of times. If you ever need to add water to your batteries, you always use distilled water. And the way these work is a certain number of balls float to the top whenever you uh, get a little bit of acid out of each cell. And for this one, it just says if all of them go up, it's 100%. And then there's a graph, which we'll also show you a picture of. This will come on the packaging of the battery tester, but basically it just tells you how to read it specifically in case they're not all fully charged. Then I decided to give this battery cleaner and acid detector a uh, try that I found at Walmart. So you spray it on there, it's kind of yellow, but if there's acid there, it turns pink. You can see a little bit of it here, and that's because I was you know, messing with it and had the terminal open, so I'm sure I spilled a couple of drops with a battery tester. Then the direction said to clean all that off with by flushing it with water. Um, so I had the distilled water that I used with the paper towels just to wipe everything down because I couldn't really just you know pour water over it or anything like that. After that, I thought I'd use this battery corrosion preventer spray to uh, hopefully keep any new corrosion from forming. So I just went over all the terminals with that. Guys, just remember that batteries last a lot longer if you take care of them properly. If you don't ever put water in them, you don't ever keep them charged, they'll last six months or a year. But if you take good care of them, they should last you for years to come. Do not forget to hit that subscribe button.